What's going on guys, Victor here and back with another video. I'm here with Tom Lewis again and in this week's video he's going to talk to you guys about how to choose the size of the flare hawk jig. So we're talking about either the one, the one and a half or the two ounce. He's going to go over when you should be throwing them depending on the current given situation and the profile of the jig. All right, I'll give it over to him. Hey, welcome back guys. Um, basically there's three sizes of snook jigs that we have on the market. It's a full size two ounce and a half and it's the one and these are the three that well you know that we sell the most of and that we fish ourselves and everybody you know primarily is you know all these sizes have their purpose in place depending on where you're at what the current is the depth of the water how hard the wind's blowing um primarily your two is going to be for stronger current faster current deeper water. Um, your ounce and a half, I'm going to call this my your universal jig because this is, this is what we sell the most of. You can actually use this jig in six foot of water all the way to 25 feet once you learn how to jig fish by throwing up current for the depth. The deeper the water, the faster the current, the farther you throw it up there to get it down. And then the one ounce, the overlooked one ounce, one ounce jig has its purpose. Certain bridges with shadow lines, with less current, maybe not as deep like Fort Pierce. We have places in our inlet that's 50 feet deep. You wouldn't want to throw a one ounce here. But you take places on the west coast and down south where your average depth's 10 foot or less, those little one ounce jig will catch more fish than the other two sizes. Um, one thing that I really like about the one ounce is during the mullet run, if you can get a shadow line with a snooker staged on, you can take this one ounce jig and you can run it across the surface in front of the shadow line where the fish are staged. And preferably when I do that, I'm going to use an all white jig. Okay, whether it's a blue tail or red tail, it doesn't matter. And when you run this one ounce, because I cut the profile down on it a little less, it's a little bit more streamlined. It has a flare, has a nice flare, but in the water, it's a little bit more streamlined. And when you run this, all white jig on these snook, on these mullet schools, the jig looks just like a mullet. I cannot tell you how many hundreds of snook that I've caught throwing a top water one ounce jig. And I call it top water because that's really what it is. And nothing more exciting than to have a 20 pound snook bust your jig that's one inch under the water. Actually the hook is, is running on the edge of the water and the eye of the hook and the, and the loop knot is running right there and the jig head is just under the water running across in front of these fish and when they're hitting these mullet and they're blowing up on them they're popping them one ounce jig will get it done too okay <clears throat> by uh by demand and being asked <clears throat> we were asked to come out with a sparky jig head style that they use for stripers and stuff up north and uh we're calling this the sweeper it's a real wide head this is actually a three ounce. It's got eyes on it, and we put gills on it. And the reason we created this was in a, some currents allows for a bigger profile without kicking it up on the surface. You can go to a really, 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 really big flare. As you can see, this is really, really a big flare. It looks like a mop, okay? Certain situations with this, because the profile is so much bigger than your standard jig and again this is a two ounce jig and you can see what the difference is between the two profiles okay this has its purpose this is my favorite jig of all time right here I probably will use this jig 70% of the time I fish however there are certain times when you need a big profile because he's big bait are running and when he's bunker and he's big bait are running and he's snooker on these big baits, you need a bigger pro profile. So we come out with a three ounce. This will be available probably sometime before Thanksgiving and possibly even before then. And we're going to do the ounce and a half and we're going to do a two ounce in the same exact style. And that those will be available sometime probably before Christmas. 